Good communication is vital, and one local business owner is making sure children with language development problems are getting the help they need. News for Jack's reporter Brittany Muller spoke with the owner of a speech therapy business as we continue to profile black-owned businesses in Jacksonville. We're working on our g sound. Kalonda Henry is working on articulation with four-year-old Milan. Garbage. Oh, make your tongue lazy. Garbage. Garbage. Speech therapy primarily focuses on articulation, so how we say words, pronounce words. And then when we talk about language therapy, we're talking about a development perspective. Henry started her business, Broad Horizon Speech Therapy, last year. It's an agency specializing in early developmental speech disorders from infants to 18-year-olds. Why is it so important to make sure that kids get the necessary speech therapy as a young child? As the gap grows larger and time is missed for vital things that the child could be learning at the time, make your tongue lazy, ghost. Ghost. Henry says many kids with language development come from underserved populations where the resources are just not there. Well, Henry says less than a quarter of African Americans are represented in the speech pathology field. She says she can be an inspiration and connect with her young clients. It's very important for me as a speech language pathologist and specifically African American to continue to promote my services and also for children who receive services. It's a comfort for them sometimes to be able to see someone who looks like them. Milan's mother says she's seen progress within the past six months. It gives her somebody to look up to, someone that looks like her in essence, so she knows that she can do whatever she wants to do. From working with private clients and in schools, Henry says communication plays a large part in a child's overall development. She says she's passionate about serving the Jacksonville community as a DCPS graduate from Ed White herself. Brittany Muller, Channel 4, The Local Station.